Hi, boys and girls. This book is called Swimmy by Leo Leone. And Swimmy is the title, and it's right here. And Leo Leone is the author. And then we have the title page that has all of that same information. And Swimmy is right here. A happy school of little fish lived in a corner of the sea somewhere. They were all red. Only one of them was a, as black as a mussel shell. He swam faster than his brothers and sisters. His name was Swimmy. So look closely, see all the red fish? There's Swimmy right there. One day, a tuna fish, swift, fierce, and very hungry, came darting through the waves. In one gulp, he swallowed all the little red fish. Only Swimmy escaped. So look closely. Where's Swimmy? Right down here. He swam away in the deep, wet world. He was scared, lonely, and very sad. But the sea was full of wonderful creatures, and as he swam from marvel to marvel, Swimmy was happy again. He saw a Medusa made of rainbow jelly. Look at this jellyfish. And there's Swimmy. A lobster who walked about like a water moving machine. Swimmy. Strange fish pulled by an invisible thread. Look at all these fish. Ooh, they're a lot bigger than Swimmy. A forest of seaweeds grown from sugar candy rocks. Look at the seaweed. And of course, there's Swimmy. An eel whose tail was almost too far away to remember. See the eel's mouth? And then you follow it all the way back here to the tail where Swimmy is. And see anemones who look like pink palm trees swaying in the wind. Look at that. And of course, Swimmy. Then, hidden in the dark shade of rocks and weeds, he saw a school of little fish just like his own. Let's go and swim and play and see things, he said happily. We can't, said the little red fish. The big fish will eat us all. But you can't just lie there, said Swimmy. We must think of something. Ooh, so they have a problem. What are they going to do? Swimmy thought and thought and thought. Then suddenly he said, I have it. We are going to swim all together like the biggest fish in the sea. He taught them to swim close together, each in his own place. Hmm. And when they had learned to swim like one giant fish, he said, I'll be the eye. Do you see the eye? What does this look like? The mouth and the tail? Ooh, that's a big looking fish. And so they swam in the cool morning water and in the midday sun and chased the big fish away. Look at those big fish go. The end.